In this video, you will learn how to resolve this warning relative to the draft exceeds the limit. Stiffness should be increased and building analysis must be repeated in both direction 1 and direction 2. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Here is our free channel where we teach and train civil engineers on the proper way to carry out modeling, loading analysis and design of civil engineering structures successfully. Let us go straight away into the video of today. I will be minimizing this and here is the structure we will be using for at first we will carry out the analysis of this structure. So already at the analysis tab I click on the building analysis get to analysis right there click on the building analysis options so I want to analyze and design that is why I'm checking those two provisions okay build analysis we do the program of seconds to carry out the building analysis successfully Your analysis is completed and here is the warning that we have never ignore this warning whenever you have this warning it may not necessarily interrupt your analysis okay so you can see over here the building analysis completed successfully meaning this warning doesn't interrupt your analysis because it is not an error but it's a warning that you wouldn't ignore it so we will be resolving this right away in this video so i'll click on the okay options and then I will have to close this right away and close this as well. So here is the analytical model of the structure after analysis. So we'll close this for now and then we get back to the main model. Okay, the physical model right here. So that means that the primary column, which is the single column that is carrying the whole structure, uh, is actually weak at the base of the structure and including at the first floor. And so the sections of the single primary column should be strengthened by increasing it successfully. So what we need to do now is we select this uh, post concrete columns right there. Okay, let's get to the property and then right click with the drop down menu the property. The property we have this diameter of the circular columns to be 1000 millimeters right there. So we can come to the uh, that provisions and then be able to navigate to this. Uh, Positions and increase the diameter to be 1200 right there. Click on OK options and update that. Okay, so this is going to nullify the analysis. Okay, click on the waste options to have the size of the column increase just like that. Let us click on the close options right there. So we will also increase the size of the uh, first floor uh, columns. Okay size of the second floor column right there. So we right click and then get to the property right there. So we keep in 1200 millimeters right there. Click on the object and close. So at this point, we will be running the analysis because that is what the uh, warning actually uh, tell us. Okay. As you are seeing here, yeah, it says stiffness should be increased. Okay. And the analysis must be repeated. So we have increased the stiffness. Okay. So this is how you you increase the stiffness okay of a structural member all right so we'll run the analysis right away minimize this okay so we run it to see if we actually have that error again sorry not error that one in again okay so click on build analysis right there and get to the analysis tab in the build analysis dialog and select build analysis then we check these two options for designs okay building analysis right So let's give the program some seconds to actually carry out the analysis and design the members and then we see whether we have actually verified that warning successfully. Alright, 
So, as you can see, the relative story graph satisfies the limit, meaning we have resolved that particular one in successfully. Okay, so this is how you carry out uh, this kind of uh, warning, how you tackle it successfully, just as you have done. Okay, so if you have any questions, you can drop it over there in the comment sections and we attend to your questions accordingly. Okay, don't forget to like, do not forget to subscribe to this channel. Stay tuned for more useful lessons of this kind. Stay safe and let's see you in the next presentation. Bye for